today is finally it's finally my vaccination day this is my first dose of vaccination it's going to be at 11 30 today right now it's 8 30 a.m so i'm just gonna maybe try to vlog the process and then maybe the side effects if i have one i just showered right now i'm just gonna do my skincare routine or maybe a little bit of makeup i'm not sure yet but usually when i go out in the morning especially during since this pandemic started i do not shower because it is early in the morning but today i'm gonna go get my vaccine so i had i have to shower so now i'm just gonna cleanse my face with this micellar water and then when i come back later i'm just gonna do the full the full routine on my skin i like this micellar water compared i have two this one and the garnier one but i prefer this one more because i can use it around my eyes it doesn't irritate my eyes at all after that i'm just gonna put on some sunscreen and that's it makeup when I go run errands but I'm feeling pretty good today I'm getting vaccinated so I'm gonna wear a little bit of makeup this dry shampoo and this dry conditioner which handbag should I bring? this one, this black one or this transparent one I'm just gonna go with this one this bag is falling apart, but it is my favorite bag. This one is from Zara. I got this one from when I was in Beirut. So these are the stuff that I'm gonna bring. We have hand sanitizer, my ID, and then some pants because I believe I'm gonna have to sign some papers later on. My lip balm and my hand cream in case the place is gonna be too cold so I do not want my hand to be dry all these things are going into my bag I just finished eating and I had roti chanai and I was contemplating whether to have coffee or not and I decided not to I just had warm water I have around an hour before I have to leave the house and right now I'm just gonna do some some editing for my reels on Instagram I have arrived at the location but my appointment is not until 11.30 right now it's only 10.40 yeah at least I'm not lost at least I'm here now so I'm glad because I always I'm so bad with direction at least I'm here now so yeah i'm gonna go now because it's already 11 15 and my friend told me to double mask to wear double mask so i'm gonna do that the hall is just there i'm just gonna park here i'm not even bothered to go and park inside i can just walk to there <laughs>
Dah cek nak iris cek. Terima kasih. It's been 4 hours now since I got the vaccine. I'm feeling okay. It's just that my left arm where I was injected feel a little sore. Uh, after my vaccination just now, I went to a petrol station because I need to fill my petrol. And then I went to the convenience store at the petrol station and it's called Family Mart. Family Mart. I got this onigiri. It's my favorite coconut water. I'm gonna have to eat one of these because I want to take my medication because I'm, I feel like the headache is coming. I'm gonna come back and do another checkup. It is 8.15 p.m. now. I slept for almost five hours. I have showered and now I'm just gonna do my skincare routine and then I wanna go back to sleep because I need to work tomorrow. I'm gonna use this too. This is the toner, the exfoliating toner and this is the the essence. So while I'm doing my skincare, I'm just gonna talk about how I'm feeling right now. Just now, when I went to sleep after I I took my medication, I took a Panadol, only one, only one tablet. I felt a bit nauseous and it was, I was a bit, uh, I felt a little headache as well. But then I went to sleep and I woke up. I'm okay now, but the headache is still there, but it's very bearable. It's just a minimal headache. About my arm, my arm is uh, still feeling sore, but it's not that bad. I can still feel the soreness on my arm, especially if I bend it like this, I fold my arm or maybe I sleep on this arm, I can feel the soreness, but overall, it's not bad at all. I need to wait for my face to dry because I need to put my adapter in. Oh, I didn't tell you, I got Pfizer vaccine just now. My brother also got the same one and his experience uh, with the first dose was not that bad at all but the second one will be very intense so today I had my first dose my experience at the center just now it was really really good it was very smooth it was very it was not crowded at all and it was very fast I went in at 11 30 I went out at 12 so the total was 30 minutes for everything from the registration until um, the vaccination and then a few minutes in the to see if you have like a immediate side effect or not I think my face is dry now I'm gonna update you again tomorrow if I have any other side effect I feel like this is the most boring vlog ever but it is my first time doing vlog I'm not really I don't really know like what to film what to talk about but as long as i am doing it i think it will be it will be okay now i'm just gonna seal everything with a moisturizer i guess uh, that's it for today i'm gonna see you on the next vlog bye bye but it's the second day of my vaccination and i am so excited but not really excited for the post vaccination though because i heard that it's gonna be more intense than the first dose but yeah I thought of wearing makeup today but I am in the middle of pre-menstruation so I have a lot of pimples whenever I have a lot of pimples I do not like to wear makeup because I do not want to disturb the pimples my appointment is at 11 30 but right now it's only 9 17 I always like to be out of the house earlier because I'm always anxious if I don't make it on time. The vaccine place is quite far from my place. It is 30 minutes away and yeah. I went to fill up the petrol just now because my car needs it and I bought some breakfast. So I'm just gonna show you what I got. I got 
Let's try latte and two on a giri. I just arrived at the vaccination center, but I am one hour earlier than my appointment, so I'm just gonna wait outside here until maybe 15 minutes before my appointment, and then I will go inside. <laughs> It's been eight hours since my vaccination. I'm feeling still. I'm still feeling fine, but I am a little bit tired. On the upper arm, it feels uh, hurt to the touch, but not too bad. Not so much updates, but of course I will keep you updated if anything happened. I hope it's not gonna be too bad. So it has been twelve hours. I am on my bed getting ready to sleep and i'm wearing something long sleeve and long pants because i'm feeling a little bit feverish my arm is getting more sore if especially if i move it like like this i can feel the soreness from the injection area since i'm feeling a little bit feverish i'm gonna take two panadols before i go to sleep yeah i think that's it i'm gonna take my panadol and then I will try to I will try to go to sleep. Hello. So fast forward to the future me. This is me like a few hours before I upload this video. I realized that I didn't I didn't do any outro for my vaccination vlog. The last footage was me taking the Panadol and that was it. I'm just gonna do a little recap on what happened during my vaccination process. The first dose was not bad at all. I only had a slight headache on the day of the vaccination, a slight headache, and then I felt a little nauseous and I slept the whole day during the day and slept again at night and I went to work on the next day like normal so it was not bad and then fast forward to the second dose the second dose was even better than the first dose I thought it was gonna be very very bad but it was not so fortunately for me yep that was my experience I had maybe a little bit of headache but I think that's it I was just feeling tired the whole day the vaccination process for me was very very I will say very smooth I didn't have any major side effects which is very fortunate for me but for the vlog it is very boring I would say that it is a very boring vaccination process because I watch a lot of uh, vaccination vlog and there were like so much drama and mine was like, yep, just me and my bad camera angle, but that's fine. I enjoy making the vlog. I enjoy editing the vlog and I hope you like it as well. And if you like this video, please press the like button and subscribe to my channel. And I also did this makeup. This is just my everyday makeup because I slept at five because I was editing this vlog. If you like uh, to see makeup videos beauty videos you can follow me on instagram and subscribe to this channel and thank you for watching i'll see you on my next video and bye bye